All new at five now after our cameras caught this heated confrontation just a few months ago between a panhandler and a man who offered him a job. Manatee County has been working to make some changes. Starting next week, a new rule goes into effect that will stop panhandling on busy roads. ABC Action News reporter Wendy Lane explains how the new law is supposed to make people safer out there. I've been hit with mirrors on cars. Joe Vasta says a life of addiction had him panhandling on the streets of Florida for decades. I'd be so drunk sometimes out there and holding my sign and just walk right out and not even know nothing. Manatee County officials don't want that happening. That's why they passed a new ordinance that bans the exchange of money or anything from a vehicle to a pedestrian. Commissioners say the purpose is to improve pedestrian safety. Um, I think it's a good step and because I definitely see it as a safety issue. Starting next week, it will be illegal for panhandlers or pedestrians to remain on medians of highly trafficked roads in unincorporated Manatee County, like the ramps on I-75 that are normally a hot spot for panhandlers. Majority are probably with addiction issues, mental health issues. Robin Richmond says panhandling was a way to feed her addiction without turning to prostitution. Now, thanks to Harvest House, her and Joe are both sober, living normal lives with normal jobs. They say the new law is a good thing. They're out there and they're not in the right frame of mind. They're under the influence of drugs or alcohol or the right frame of mind, mental health issues. And um, we're losing so many people as it is already. In Manatee County, Wendy Lane, ABC Action News.